Welcome back to the Ancestral Findings Podcast. A terrific genealogy project you can do with kids is to create a family photo collage. There are a few different ways to do this, with almost endless ways of deciding on a theme for it. These are a few ideas you can use when deciding to create a genealogy photo collage with the child or grandchild you love. An excellent genealogy project for kids that they are sure to find to be a lot of fun is creating a family photo collage. This is a great way for them to learn who their ancestors are, based on you going over identities and relationships with them as you sort through old photographs together. Children love being able to put a face to a name just as much as you do. It also helps keep a genealogy project interesting for them. If someone is just a name and a date on a piece of paper, it isn't necessarily as interesting or engaging for them as being able to see the actual person and know they were real. This may spark an interest in them to know more about the family and their other ancestors, maybe even the ones for whom no photos exist or are known to exist. Maybe your child or grandchild will be the one to find them. In any case, it is a delightful way for you to spend time together doing something that you will both undoubtedly enjoy. There are a couple of solid ways to do a genealogy photo collage project with a child. You can do it freeform on cardboard paper and then frame it or pin it to a corkboard when you're done. Or you can do it using one or more photo frames with shapes cut out in the matting for the placement of several photos in one frame. Either way, makes a great photo collage project. If you are doing it freeform, decide on a theme for the collage, such as moms and daughters, or dads and sons, or grandparents and grandchildren, or multiple generations in one photo, or childhood photos of all relatives for which you have childhood photos, holiday photos, vacation photos, school photos, photos with pets, and even photos grouped by the decade they were taken. These are just some suggestions. Use your imagination to come up with a theme you like best. You and your child or grandchild can go through these photos, group them, and label them on different pieces of cardboard paper, decorate the paper with artwork or scrapbooking accessories, then tape the pieces of cardboard paper together, or glue or paste them, to form one large collage. The resulting collage can be framed, displayed as is on a wall, or even gifted to a member of the family who would really love it. Kids are usually pretty excited about making something for a gift for someone they love. It's a little easier if you are using multi-photo frames. Your child can write in labels under the individual photos, or use a label maker to make the labels, and can even decorate the matting, if desired. Either method of making a photo collage is a terrific genealogy project that you and your child or grandchild can enjoy doing together. The child has fun while learning about genealogy, and when you're done, you have a great family heirloom you can save or gift to someone. This is a winning genealogy project. Thanks for listening to the Ancestral Findings Podcast. Be sure to visit AncestralFindings.com to download a free genealogy ebook and sign up for the weekly historical postcard giveaway. I hope you have a wonderful day and happy searching. <laughs>